device. Items that you're both uh, you're familiar with, both of which I think, but I wanted to make certain. Uh, one, the crash of the B-52 carrying nuclear weapons uh, late yesterday afternoon. Uh, during the night, our people in states uh, worked with representatives of the Danish government uh, uh, on a news release, which is scheduled to be put out at 10 o'clock this morning, which simply acknowledges that a B-52 carrying uh, nuclear weapons, all of which were unarmed, crashed and uh, we anticipate no, no danger from it. It crashed, as you probably know, seven and a half miles from Thule, Greenland, on the ice. It burned it, it uh, either all or in major part fell through the ice into 250 feet of water. The Danes have an election tomorrow. Today is the last day of the campaign. The statement made is sensitive in relation to the election. I think the Danes and state and we are all in complete agreement on what should be said. I'm told by our people, inclusive of Harold Brown and others who are familiar in detail with nuclear technology, there is no danger from this. Good. First item. Second item, you undoubtedly know that we think that uh, the long-expected attack on Khe Sanh in South Vietnam has been initiated. Substantial artillery and mortar fire and ground action is taking place there. Westmoreland believes he is fully prepared to meet it. I have nothing further to add. What, do they have very heavy casualties? The enemy there yesterday, I heard on the radio, had 450 Viet Cong killed well, and 17 Americans. Mr. President, I just, I just, uh, I'm very skeptical of, of that size. Uh, mm -hmm. our, our reports don't indicate, they, they re our reports indicate a, an extensive action, but they don't indicate that large a number killed. Good. Anything else? No, sir, that's all. Looks like that uh, George Wilson over there is really living in that Pentagon he, well, with the damn story. He's getting about half right. That's a hell of it. And, and I don't know quite what to do about it. I talked some to the Post about it We were, a week ago. You may have seen we, we issued a very strong denial of one of his stories. He was absolutely wrong. Uh, this Yesterday he had one on the barrier. This morning he had one on the uh, F-111. That's right. And uh, there's just enough foundation to it, you know, to, to to give him some basis for writing. I've got to do something. I don't know quite what, but Phil Goulding and I have talked about it, and we'll we'll take some action. Good. I'll, well, I'll talk to you about right. it. I, okay. Thank you.